yesterday was not Sunday. Excuse that vlog yesterday. And the skies have cleared up. The heavens have opened up. And it's time to do the coffee jam. Hopefully the turnout is super big like last Sunday. That was freaking amazing. And uh, yeah, so sit back, relax, enjoy the vlog. Check out this bike side view shot. Cycling Freak Definitely Check out his channel as well He's uh, Incorporating a new Angle Action angle on his bike Today Which should be fantastic And I can't wait to see More of his vlog footage Alright Boom Also a simple cycling tip that was taught to me uh, by one of our uh, Sunday morning coffee jam members and he also he also uh, used to race a lot um, to increase your cadence try try riding in the little ring uh, for a few weeks everything you can on the little ring eventually your legs will compensate for how much you're spinning and you'll spin faster uh, and in a group ride you'll actually be able to hold on to the group a little bit easier uh, because of the fluctuation in speed and uh, by that time a few weeks, one to two weeks, your your legs would have caught up to how much you're spinning and you'll increase your cadence. Um, you might have to cross chain for a while, but it's totally worth it for the amount of cadence increase that you'll gain. So so that's a little tip right there and then eventually when you do switch back to the big ring after a few weeks you'll have a faster cadence because that muscle memory will be ingrained to how fast your legs can turn over the pedals because it's been doing it for a while if you try to do it in the big ring you're gonna constantly be in the small in the largest cog in the back, which uh, for doing varying terrain might suck. So that's what's up. Everyone is out in full effect. Slow motion for a dramatic effect. Yeah, nobody showed up yesterday, man. Yeah, <laughs> yesterday was terrible. Yeah. We were going to, we were going to do Palisades. Okay. Yeah, because it's a part of the...
first margarita down. Woo. One more to go. One more to go. We did that one time before. And I remember last week you cut through. Why did we cut with that light? Just <laughs> oh, I didn't cut through. No, no, you were on the, I don't know, last, last week? Oh, I got you, I got you. Yeah. You were on the sidewalk over here waiting for the light. I'm like, you know what? <laughs> yeah. Something out of the by a red light. They're taking the lead.
Just finished Sunday morning coffee jam, and wanted to um, wanted to do a review of things I discovered during the ride. So, um, so yesterday I did a three-hour trainer ride. Um, nothing extreme, just got in the miles, um, mostly spinning, and I noticed today that I was able to perform better because of those long, long, slow distance miles that I did yesterday, um, which is counter culture to what um, currently um, is the norm, which would be short workouts with high intensity on the bike or on the trainer. But what I found is long, long miles, long, slow distance miles um, I need a lot of miles to prepare my distance and physiology for um, big, big sprint events or or racing. So that helps me out a lot. Um, so if uh, short interval workouts on the on the trainer are not uh, helping you get where you want to be. Uh, you might want to try out some long, slow distance stuff every now and then. Um, go a little bit longer than you normally would. And it helped me out. I definitely recommend it now that I've tried it. Some people respond to, some people's physiology responds to minimal training. I, on the other hand, my my physiology my anatomy responds more to a lot of miles a lot of base miles like when i did the festive 500 500 kilometers uh in the eight days i felt really strong on the bike afterwards um and i wasn't doing any breakthrough stuff any high intensity stuff i was just getting in base miles and i felt really strong afterwards on the bike so um, counter to uh, what's being taught nowadays, doing short interval work, um, especially if you're on a time constraint, that's definitely better than not riding at all. But uh, if your physiology responds to long miles, then I would I would say give that a shot once again and don't totally exclude that don't throw it out the door uh, try it out see if it works for you it worked for me um, hopefully it might work for some of you who are subscribed to my channel that's all I have to say I'm out have a good weekend